Hi everyone, so today's video is going to be on essential resources for each subject in first semester. So I'll be giving you the resources for uh, your first semester. Now according to the poll, the second video, today's video should be about girls hostel tour. And I'm sorry girls, I will be able to put this video only after I get back to campus. Because right now we all are having our vacations and we are at home. So, if you want a proper, actual, really good video, I need to get back to campus. Okay, so you'll have to wait. Maybe by end of July, you'll get one soon. Okay, so let's move on to our actual video today. That is, what all do I need to refer for SEM 1? Now, here, these are the first semester subjects you will have as a CSE branch student. I am giving the resources for other branches as well. The thing is, in first semester, most almost all the BTEC uh, disciplines, all the BTEC disciplines will be having common subjects. So mechanics, mathematics, these might be common for you, you all. So you can, it'll, this video is beneficial for you guys as well. Now, first uh, five are the quite most important five subjects for CSE branch. The last two are just one credit subjects. One credit means that they only have one credit. That is, they're not having the major grades. It's like satisfactory or unsatisfactory. The first five grades are there. Like A, A plus, B, B plus, like that. Grades will be given. Okay. So, engineering, mechanics, mathematics, fundamentals of electrical and electronics engineering, effective communications, which is English, and information technology. These five are the major five subjects. Okay, I have given here LTPC means lecture, tutorial, practical, and the course credit. For mathematics, NS1001 is the course code. And these course code you will have to write in your exam sheet, answer sheet. For maths, you will have three lectures in a week, one tutorial, no practical, four credits. Now, for those of you who don't know what a tutorial is, tutorials are taken by those who do MTech and all. So, they'll come, they'll discuss the assignments, solutions, they'll write the answers on the board, they can, they'll discuss your doubts and whatever problems you have related to the subject, you can ask them. You can also even ask your professor, but yeah, this is how it is. For mechanics, two lectures, one tutorial, two practicals, and four credit subject. This is so mathematics, mechanics, they all are very important subjects because they carry four credits. Two practicals. Um, in a week, we only we only have one practical, okay? I don't know why they've written two here. We only had one practical in a week. Every week, one day. So, then what else? Um, for mechanics, you don't need to buy a lab coat or anything because this is not chemistry lab, right? So, you don't need any lab coat or anything as such for mechanics and electronics. For both of these subjects, you will be having labs effective communication is english programming in c is the only cse subject you have where your sir your professor will be teaching you c language fundamentals of electrical and electronic engineering is a uh, four credit subject which is again important this is also important three credits are there for c profession as i said before only one credit here only satisfactory and satisfactory grades Now, for mechanics, this is a textbook that you will need to use. Introduction to Mechanics by Daniel Kleppner and Robert J. Korinko. Excuse me. So, this is for engineering mechanics, this textbook. Next, for mathematics, Introduction to Real Analysis by Bartolaji and Sherbert DR. You need to download these textbooks and you can read it now. Then... Fundamentals of Electrical and Electronics Engineering, I would say go to your library once you come to campus and then learn from good textbooks. Most of these textbooks focus more on theory and questions were very less. So go to the library to find out textbooks with lots of questions and then I would say refer those textbooks. 
ఐటి ఈ బాల గురు స్వామి ప్రోగ్రామింగ్ అండ్ ఎన్సిసి దిస్ ఇస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ టెక్స్ట్ బుక్ యువర్ ప్రొఫెసర్ విల్ బీ టీచింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ దిస్ టెక్స్ట్ బుక్ ఓన్లీ ఇఫ్ ఇట్స్ డాక్టర్ వికే జీన్ హూ ఇస్ టీచింగ్ యువర్ క్లాస్ హూ ఇస్ యువర్ ప్రొఫెసర్ దెన్ హీ విల్ బీ టీచింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ దిస్ టెక్స్ట్ బుక్ ఓన్లీ అండ్ దిస్ ఇస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ yeah now let us move on to this uv curriculum for mathematics first real numbers function sequences learn like this learn in order because your sir professors will stick to this uv curriculum so you to stick to this learn in order okay everything first read like this in order itself read and go quiz one 15 percent myths and 30 percent weightages are also given here for mechanics these are the important ones every subject read and learn in order because as i said before professors are not going to skip lab experiments these labs effective communication uh, leave that subject i would say start maths mechanics and electronics now and uh um, c language dc circuits you will have first these are the lab experiments you are having this is it directly go to c language or v o c leave this introduction nothing will come from here much you can learn this from class learn c language now textbook refer e bala guru swami only most important these you can take as support so you want textbooks if you don't understand something in e bala guru swami uh, programming and ncc then refer to other textbooks yeah that's all for sem 1 now youtube channels academy for Nesu Academy X. Okay. This is the subject. Uh, this is the YouTube channel. You should refer for electronics. This is very, very good. Then, uh, here I saw his channel. This channel. Engineers Ki Paat Chala by Umesh Dandi. This one for DC Networks. For everything, you can refer to this. This is very good. now once you just learn after just learning if you want to solve some basic questions tickley academy you can check okay tickley academy for just basic questions the, the questions that he gives won't come for any of your exam just for your own understanding after in, in you can solve these questions after immediately you know learning topics and for improving yourself then these three uh, nasa academy engineers ki parchala and tikle academy for electronics mathematics dr uh, gajendra purohit engineering mathematics real analysis type real analysis also only then you will get what you want this is the sequence bounded sequence all of these you you will be having i learned all of this oh yes this is what oh this is a subject for maths then you can refer to dr gajendra purohit and someone else was also there if i am once i get it i will type in the description let us see here yeah neptil is also good real analysis neptil is good dr gajendra prohit is also good these two i would say ignited minds good for upper bounds lower bounds infimum supremum for this just for this topic refer uh, ignited minds this is also a good channel english uh, no need to refer any youtube channels it also you can refer any channel which is good god with harry is good apna college is good better than apna college it's god with harry then uh, 
then what else mechanics i would say listen to what your professor teaches i never found any good videos on engineering mechanics okay so if you have any doubts your sir will explain it really well if it's professor yashpal singh sir he will explain it really very very well and whatever doubts you have you can ask him such a good professor okay so learn it from class itself clear your doubts in class itself once the class gets over go to him and ask your doubts so yes these are the only ones these are the resources and also i will uh, in the description below i have given the links to uh, google drive with all the academic resources and those were provided by our seniors so you can check them out we have another google drive also for sem 1 resources only but the thing is uh, if you want to access it you need institute's email id you will get that only once you join the institute so there's no point if i give it to you now so once you come to come to the college and get your roll number all of those your email id and everything we'll uh, i'll share it with you okay so yes that's it for today's video so start learning and happy learning all the best